Siemens' new CEO, Joe Kayser, has a lot to smile about. The supervisory board voted unanimously to give him the post. Kayser has promised investors he will return order and calm to the company after a turbulent past couple of years. I'm well aware that I've been given a great responsibility, perhaps greater than I had originally planned to take on, and I approach this responsibility with the greatest of humility. Kayser's appointment marks the end to one of the gravest leadership crises in Siemens history. Former CEO Peter Luscher was unceremoniously forced from office just last week, amid rumors of a power struggle between Luscher and the board of directors. Analysts say chaos at the top was bad for business. Siemens products were poorly managed, poorly presented and poorly delivered. Bad marks all around. People in the company can attest to that. Kayser has set out the company's new goals. He's tasked with returning order and stability to the engineering giant. While he was CEO, Luscher laid off employees by the tens of thousands. The board hopes Kayser's reputation as a trusted Siemens veteran will help turn the page and begin a new chapter. Siemens' new CEO couldn't be more different than his predecessor. Joe Kayser has a warm sense of humor and is a company insider. But that means he's not only the solution, but also part of the problem.